38 year old Derek Miganda was addicted to alcohol and drugs for the 13 years that he was under the influence of the substances. He was not aware of the effects that he had on him and those surrounding him. Mm, I used uh, multiple substances, but uh, I'm glad to say that his recovery is possible for everyone. Miganda says his friends and family abandoned him and treated him as a disgrace. However, after a long process, they convinced him to start rehabilitation. Uh, the people taking drugs know the hell they are going through. Uh, it starts out as fun, and uh, if you're an addict, it quickly becomes trouble. Miganda says rehabilitation works and is now free of drugs and alcohol. And life in recovery is fun. We share our recovery uh, with people. We share the power of God, and uh, this is the most powerful thing we did. We get out there, we talk to people. Deliki Miganda is among the former users who attended the launch of a campaign intended to sensitize the youth about the dangers of using drugs and alcohol. I'm now three years sober. I'm three years sober. I made 27. I, I was 27 uh, August. I made three years alcohol and drug free. More people get addicted to other drugs by starting with alcohol than starting with any other drug. And before it used to be marijuana. But 40% of people start with marijuana get addicted to other drugs. 80% of people start with alcohol get addicted to other drugs. The Prime Minister, Dr. Ohana Lugunda, pledged government support. We'll do all that is possible to combat addiction, combat uh, alcoholism, and join forces with you in the fight. And then regulation is necessary because people need to know. What are these people being given? You don't know what's in that circuit. The campaign has marched around Kampala as a part of the move to sensitize the public. <laughs> Status on Hokokon Health of 2014 indicated that Uganda had the highest drinking consumption rate in East Africa. Ivan Chimuchigozi, NTV. <laughs>